Hey parents, um, I've decided to try and do a video message versus an email. I like vlogging better than I like writing. I actually like both. Anyway, here's your weekly roundup of this week. This week was all about recovering from hand, foot, and mouth. Um, it wiped out most of the kids for the week or most of the week. Um, I almost had a full house on Thursday. I had seven, which was good stuff. And the beautiful thing, if you can call it beautiful, about hand, foot, and mouth is that once everyone got it, that's the end of it. So there aren't any random kids coming and going like I had with the kids' cabin and um, so that the virus can keep getting spread or whatever. So once it's done, it's done. I hope parents that you were able to rest a little bit and kids let them sleep if they're still have a, if they still have a sore throat or anything, make sure that you give them frozen gogurts, for example, popsicles, just anything that's gonna make their throat feel good. Um, as far as if they have a, a really bad diaper rash, you wanna dry that out. Moisture is bad, dryness is good. This is just based on my experience. I'm not a doctor, um, I've never been a physician. This is just based on almost 20 years of changing diapers so there you go um but everyone will recover and i'm excited to see everyone next week um november invoices are due uh come monday and tuesday thank you and i will be closed uh wednesday and thursday i think it's the 24th and the 25th don't quote me on that for the thanksgiving holiday and i kind of don't know where to look but this is my video vlog for all you guys and um the kids that came to daycare were tired but happy so i cannot complain and thank you so much parents for keeping your kids home when they were sick because it helps get rid of this virus faster and the rona ain't got nothing on hand foot and mouth let me tell you that sucked so kisses and hugs to all the babies and kisses and hugs to you guys and i'll see you guys next week i have to figure out where to look bye